What's up, my loves? Okay, y'all, I'm back with another voiceover. This unit is from the What Lay series by Sensational, and this is um, Celeste, okay? Yes, y'all, this series is bomb. The hairline is bomb, okay? We like this series. Now, I also want to say, this unit was sent to me by Glamatress.com, so shout out to Glamatress for sending me this unit. <laughs> it's bomb, okay? So, right now, I'm just going to be styling the unit and, you know, you know, you know, the same old, same old. I'm using my Gots to Be Glued to uh, adhere to lace. <laughs> Look at me using big words. And I'm going to be putting my Sally Henson airbrush legs underneath the lace. Instead of using foundation, I like to use my Sally Henson airbrush legs, which I'm going to say all over again in my outro, okay? I know y'all get tired of hearing the same stuff. Um, yeah, I'm just going to be basically showing you guys how I do the front part and nothing else because I'm pretty sure you guys are tired of seeing the same old, same old. I do the same old in every video, so if you want to see how I lay down my wig in its entirety, just check one of my older videos. Okay, y'all, look at this lace, okay? Look at this lace, y'all. This lace is freaking phenomenal. Oh, my God. Sensational y'all came through. Like, y'all really came through with it. Now, I do want to say, once I do do my baby hairs and all of that good stuff, it's going to have a little bit of um, white <laughs> on the side. But you guys, I really know. That's got to be glue. That ain't nothing but got to be glue, okay? So, don't judge me. Don't judge me. I should have went over with my alcohol wipe, and I didn't, okay? So, right here, this is like a new trick I learned to basically get the, the lace to melt in more. And what I do is get a really fine comb, or in this case, use the comb that comes on the back of my uh, edge control, edge brush. And I put a little Gots to Be Glue on the end of it, of the lace, and then I just comb it down like that and blow it in. And for some reason, that makes it lay even better. You know what I mean? It's just a little thing that I just started doing, and I really like to do that because it, it makes my wigs lay like I want them to lay, okay? It might be in my head, but I feel like it's doing something, okay? <laughs> Don't judge me. Okay, now I'm going to be going in with my uh, Maybelline Fit Me Press Powder, and I'm just going to be applying that to uh, the hair, yeah, the hairline or to the lace, as you guys can see. And the rest is just going to be me styling the wig. There ain't a whole lot for more for me to say. So, and you guys enjoy me styling this unit. And don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you love bugs in the outro. Oh, I also want to mention that this wig is very big head friendly. I don't think I mentioned that in my outro. This wig is very, very, very big head friendly. So, big head sisters, <laughs> this one is for you. Okay, this one is for you. So, keep that in mind. Okay, now, I'm gone. See you love us in the outro. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Bye.
huge shout out to Glamatress.com for sending me this unit. I was super, super, super excited <laughs> to work with uh, Glamatress because honestly, Glamatress was the first, the very first wig site that I ever ordered from. So to be able to have uh, a chance to do this collaboration with them is truly an honor. So I really want to give them a huge shout out and say thank you so, so much, Glamatress, for sending me this gorgeous wig. Okay, y'all. Let me give, I got a mess over here. Let me give you guys the spec on this unit. This unit is by Sensational. It is from their Cloud 9 series, y'all. I am definitely feeling this series sensational. Y'all coming through, okay? You're coming through with the hairline, okay? We'll get all in, we'll get into that in a minute. <laughs> okay, so uh, this is the Sensational Cloud, from the Cloud 9 series, and this is the wig Celeste. Now, this line is called What Lace, and... uh. Uh, yeah, you know, what lace, sis. Okay, <laughs> what lace. <laughs> and um, I have Celeste, and I got it in 99J. And this is what it looks like on the stock card. And as you guys can see, it's gorgeous on the model, on the stock card. And, you know, sometimes it's a rarity. A lot of times, what a wig looks like on, on us ain't gonna look the same as the stock card. That's why I always tell people, if you're wig shopping, Look at it on the model, but then also go and YouTube it because YouTube, you can see what it really looks like, okay? Because I ain't going to tell you that. But anyways, it, all, it usually looks better on per, in person or on a person than it does on the model, but it does, it looks good on the model as well. So it's like a booklet type thing, and it's just showing you guys uh, the models again. And over here is showing you what a customized, undetectable... Uh, hairline looks like so that's that over there and on the back it's showing you the differences between a uh, hairline that's not pre-tweezed or has any manipulation done to it versus what this hairline looks like and that is the biggest difference that is the biggest thing with this particular line I'm looking kind of kind of orange what is going on lighting let's see can we get it together there we go <laughs> but um yeah, that is the main difference when it comes to this particular line. I love this line. I think this line is amazing. And I've only tried, this is my second wig from this series, and I love it as much as I love the other one. This one isn't quite as long as Raina, so I, I'm glad about that because I don't like super, super, super long hair. But this is pretty long. Like, don't get me wrong, I'm going to show you guys in a minute how long this hair is. But we're going to, I really want to show you guys this hairline, so... This is the hairline, and this is without any manipulation whatsoever. This is what the hairline just looks like, like, without any manipulation. It's a beautiful, like, the hairline is amazing. And as far as I can see, the hairline is amazing on all of these wigs. Um, I, the only one, I, I think it's only three. So, I own Raina. This is Celeste. I do not have Morgan. So, Morgan could possibly be our 20k giveaway okay <laughs> morgan may be our 20k giveaway but we'll get into that later y'all i also want to say thank you guys so much i think by the time this video goes up i will be at 17k let's see where we at now yeah i think by the time this video goes up i'll be at 17k so i want to say thank you guys so so much for 17k we're on the road to 20k, so once we hit 20k, we you guys know we'll be doing another giveaway, <laughs> another giveaway. So shout out, shout out to y'all, okay? <laughs> but anyways, I love this wig. Now with this particular unit, I did not wear uh, a wig cap, and that is something new to me. I, I always wear a wig cap. Like y'all know, have you ever seen me without a wig cap? Like I don't play about my wig cap. But because um, I noticed that you could see like that line where the wig cap start, even when I use my pressed powder, I could still see the line where the wig cap start. I did notice that somebody was like, well, why you ain't put no pressed powder on it? I always use pressed powder, so, uh, but you could still see it. And I think it's just because my wig caps are too light. <laughs> so, and even when I got a darker one, I feel like you could still see it as well because maybe it was too dark. So to me, with this line, with this series, and with any uh, pre-flux unit, uh, synthetic unit that I have, I noticed that I like them better without a wig cap. So, we did the no wig cap thing here. And I love uh, this unit. 
Now, what I also want to say, y'all, I feel like I ramble on and on. And I said I was going to make my video shorter. I use my Sally Henson. This is for the people that are new to my channel. I use the Sally Henson underneath, um, and I got to get some more. I use it underneath my, my wig instead of using makeup. And even with my um, human hair wigs, instead of bleaching my knots, I just use my Sally Henson airbrush legs. And I use the shade Medium Glow. And people have been asking me why, you know, what shade I use. And honestly, this was the only shade available. So I was hoping it worked. And it worked pretty good. So that's the only thing that I put underneath my cap. And then I just apply the unit. So are we feeling this? Do y'all like this wig? Like, do y'all like it more than Raina? Let me know if you like this one. Or do you prefer Raina? Let me know down below in the comments. And yeah, let me do you guys a quick a lint check. And we'll do a full 360. And we can wrap this thing up. So this is how long the wig is. I'm sorry if you see my bra, the shirt is see-through. <laughs> but this is how long the wig is. How long? And it's basically to my abdomen. As you guys know, Raina was basically waist length on me, and I am 5'4". Okay, so yeah, I am 5'4", and this is, it comes to my abdomen. So, yeah. So let me give you guys a 4360 in the back. I hope you guys can't see nothing because... One of my plaits was sticking out. I was like, oh, that's why <laughs> that's why we wear our wig cap. It wasn't a plait. It's like my hair is braided up. And at the end, I have it in a ponytail. And for some reason, that had escaped the ponytail in the back. But anyways, let me give you guys a 4360. So this is obviously the unit in the front. This is it on the left side. This is it in the back. And this is it on the right side. Okay, so, yeah, that's basically it. I would definitely, definitely recommend you guys checking out Glamatress.com. I will have a direct link to this hair and to their site down below in the description box. I've been using Glamatress for years now, for at least two years. I think I've been wearing wigs now for about two or three years. And I have been using them for, for two or three years and I've never had any problems with them. I love their site. Their wigs I usually come within two or three days to Alabama. Um, I don't I can't speak for nowhere else, but I know to Alabama their wigs always have come to me within two or three days. So I love Glamatress. And yeah, if you guys are interested in this wig, like I said, we'll have all of that information down below. Once again, shout out to Glamatress for sponsoring this video. I really, really do appreciate it. And if you like this video, give me a thumbs up. And sis, if you're not already subscribed, click that subscribe button. Like, we're on the road to 20K, and then we're going to have a giveaway, okay? 20K, and then we're going to have a giveaway. And, y'all, um, I don't know. That, that's probably already announced, because I think this video is going to come after that video. So, I'm not going to even say that. So, yeah, 20K giveaway. We on the road. Like, we, we almost there, okay? We almost there. So, yeah, uh, like, comment, and subscribe. And if you're not already following me on all my social media platforms, I am Disastrous Beauty on both IG and Facebook. I'm here to Missy on Snapchat. And I'm Disastrous Beauty on Twitter. And I will see you, love bugs, next time. Bye.